Charles Austin pumps, EDM of choice, Sodic machines. This is a wire eroding machine. A, what is it? Why do you like them? Uh, so this is a wire machine. Uh, the reason I like it is the quality of build and uh, the accuracy that it wires things. Um, the use of like interface is very good. Uh, We're taking a step back. When you say the build, though, solid casting, solid it's not moving. Machine, yeah, solid machine. It, you know, we've had no issues with it over the four years we've had it. Um, and I know it's a linear drive mode, so obviously faster. Well, this, these machines aren't about speed; it's more no, accuracy. No, no, accuracy. Yeah, the, the linear drives stop all the like bearing rumble that you'd get, so you oh. don't get any of that transferring onto the job. So oh. it's and in the wire itself, I mean maybe just a simple part of the process but loading it and actually should it break it auto auto feeds yeah, as well the machine like pretty much deals itself once it's going it auto reels if it has a wire breakage very rare to be honest um but no you know it's a long machine designed to run through the night to basically save as much money as you can on yeah. a job so rather than keeping your spindles turning it's keeping you keeping your wire eroding yeah basically yeah, yeah. and you've got complete confidence that'll run overnight though. yes yeah yeah barring any like wire breakages sometimes if you're doing a really complex job or it because it uh wires a um how can i say if you're wiring a hole you can it like takes the slug out so sometimes that can fall that can cause issues yeah. but but that's just the nature of wiring you know it's yeah so in terms of axes, how many, three axes, is yes. that right? Yes, that's right, yeah. So it can basically uh, cut multiple shapes, so it could do a square to a circle at the bottom, or right. multiple angles. It, okay, so that wire can be coming in at diagonals, I mean, I'm trying to visualise that. So both heads basically can move all about um, to produce any shape that you tell it that you want it to do. And obviously there's a limit on the angle, because of the much the heads can move apart from each other. But. but complex parts not an issue no not an issue at all we couldn't we couldn't do the quality and the accuracy tool making that we do about it now you say accuracy it's not so well we'll come to that well accuracy it'll go to how many microns uh one one that's a that's yeah. pretty accurate machine in there now in terms of that the accuracy then actually controlling it programming it you've got your touch screen in the background there easy yeah, to use yeah, it's pretty much easy to use yeah. uh, once we've sent over what we need to the machine it's pretty much guides you through it really yeah the okay. yeah so nice and easy nice and intuitive yeah yeah you know you've got to be on the ball obviously yeah. it's easy to mess a job up but and it's not i mean we often find it's not just about i mean great great machine but your support your, su your training and things like that yeah so the after service that was brilliant uh, the machine comes with training we've all been on it and it's like three days it's very good yeah i've had any issues in the past i've phoned them up and they've uh, they've been straight on it we've sent them programs stuff like that so exactly what you need so in terms of the parts you're making though i mean you mentioned about the accuracy early but you said it's not just about the the accuracy but you know you're using an injector well you said about it Ejector pin, is that yeah, right? Yeah, so some of the ejector pins, uh, depending on what material, so right. the job that's in there now, that is uh, moulding Santa Preen. So we can't have uh, like an O1 gap because that'll right. flash on the plastic part. So, okay, so you're putting, you're testing with your own eject, manual ejector pin as such, yeah, and you can feel part. the tolerances. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So basically you're making extremely complex parts for this machine? Yes. And sounds like it's a very simple machine to use and giving you that accuracy yes it is yes nice and simple david thank you very much no that's it master of edm and helped <laughs> with the sodic machines thank you very much